Today's race day replay is brought to you by FAST, the leading name in fuel air spark technology. So let's do this. Yeah, we're live from Lucas Oil Raceway in the town. Put it in the beams. Let's see what's going to happen. Three coming out. 032 to 035. Top in charge. Who's going to be? It's going to be Dwayne Mills. Call a Gorilla. 388 to 199 miles an hour. Kluger goes 397. A world champion. Can he take it home here in the world finals, though? Cooper on the right hand side, PTP doing a tune as he'll put it to beams. Jason Lee out there saying, Come on, bring it. Ferris on the left hand side has found a ton of power. They figured it out. Put it in the beams. Street Outlaw style. Man, Ferris gets him on a whole shot. Look at how the rules in the air. Top eight charge. Look at Ferris. 442 and 167. Daniel Ferris takes the victory right there. Yeah, baby. Charlie Cooper goes 445 and 162. The world champ goes home runner up. But one. So Ricky Pennington officially doubled up there and stock super stock in open cap. Wow. That's awesome. Real quick, Ricky Pennington, congratulations, man. He is the official champion of both of those categories. Put it in the main, says Mass again. Left hand side leaves. Here comes Ricky. This is the Rumble final round. Might as well stay here, right? Top in charge. Who's it gonna be? This is a heck of a final triple zero reaction time. Nicholas Mass. But that's not what this is about. Stamps is going against Moisture in the final round. Shut uh, the Mopar once again going against the Mustang. Put it in the beams. This should be the last pair down the racetrack. Both drivers agree. Through the strike, but it's going to be double breakout victory. Jerry Stamps, 036 on a tree, breaks out by 17 thousandths. Mike was 075, breaks out. Here comes your ETA performance products, the Stounder Super Stock final round. Ross Barrens, left hand side, Edgar Wattin, West Wisconsin, 975. Jeff Freeze trying to double up this weekend, 950 on the right hand side. Both drivers away green as they go in the direction. Can Jeff Freeze double up? He won victory last night. Can he win the NMC version about it? The right hand side. Top in charge. No, he can't. Russ Barrens takes it though. Congratulations there. Brings up the automatic down to 1081. Who's going to go in first? The ATI car puts it in the beams. Here comes Stevenson. The left hand side to Firebird. Final round. Stock Super Stock combo. Two good reaction times, man. This is going to be a race to the finish. Stevenson, Dool, Dool, Stevenson, Pontiac, Mopar, Mopar, Pontiac, it's going to be Pontiac. 10 and he brings up a 9,000. Can he take the victory? Pre-stage on. Joe puts it in the beams. Here comes Josh to the left-hand side. So Josh gets a reaction time advantage. Top in charge. Who's it going to be? It's going to be Joe Bacaro. 734, 189. Look at that. Takes the victory. Josh is 030 on the tree. Goes 797 Pro. Seventy three four in uh, DeChico in each hand. All right, so here we go. Final round, as I was saying, the amount of bad side is Don O'Neill. Good to see him in the final round. Roger Wellman here in the pro. Talking about old school race car, man. That looks like an ex pro stock car. Let's see what happens. So the crazy man, right hand side, does a little purging. The bad scientist, left hand side, is slowly bring it forward. Both drivers in. Green, green. Man, we got a race to the stripe on this one. Almost identical reaction times. Here comes the bad scientist, top in charge. Don O'Neill takes the victory. 014 to the tree. One penny to him. Left hand side, Gardendale, Alabama. 64 Chevelle. 1060 is the number. Susan Roush with the other hand. Coming out of the. Uh, 
As he puts it in the beams uh, on the left-hand side, the lady's going to put it in the beams on the right-hand side. Both of these drivers still have a shot, I think, at the World Championship. I don't know the exact numbers, but it's good to see them in the final round here. Ricky's away. Susan's going to come and chase. Imagine that pressure. So Cameron's going to try to give him a run for his money. So far, he's been doing good. Pre-stage on, left-hand side. Pre-stage on, right-hand side. Massey Gale's in. Massey's in, right-hand side as he's barely blinking that bulb. He spins it away, so he's not going to do it. Cameron Massey is going to take the win right there. 471 and 149, so he takes the big check home. Good. That last pass, Hudson, Florida, the 04 Mustang. Big block forward. Well, BRF, whatever that means. It's 400 cubic inches, so can't be a big block. Let's put it in the beams. Your number one qualifier. Nice side by side wheel stand. Blake gets him off the tree. The Robbie Power, top in charge. 789, 171 miles an hour. He puts it in the high factory supercars. It's the longer stone. We're the left hand side of the red low for a 16 Mustang. With that eight points and racing back cam, supporter of the NMCA. Let's see what's going to happen in the final round. This should be a good one. Both cars have been in the 20s. As they're going to put it in the babes. Battle of the Mustangs. Wow, Chuck Watson gets a huge hole shot. Can he hold him off? Soon coming, but I think it's going to be all Watson. Watson gets it on a hole shot. Double O six. The uh, big check. Remember, I think the winner does receive an LSX block, also courtesy of Chevrolet Performance and Skang and Dickey. So that's pretty exciting. Pressure on. That's how we like it. Both sides of the uh, racetrack is green. Anderson, Lumsden, Lumsden, Anderson. Gonna be Anderson goes dead on with a zero. 029 reaction time. Taylor was 039. Support percent. here at the World Finals and of course Chevrolet performance. Big shout out to them. Jesse Wilson. He is uh, the champ, I believe, in the left hand side. Did we officially announce that? I can't even remember. Yeah, he. So this is the final Chevrolet performance stock. Well, Haley gets on the tree. Is it going to be enough? Your champ is charging hard. Top in. It's going to be Roosevelt on a whole shot. 1023 under 29 miles per hour. Look at that. 041. Your world champ goes and he up. He gets a single in the finals. So Ron Pierce is going to put it in the beams. 53 Studebay here. Coming alive from the right hand side. Let's see what's going to happen. 108 60 foot. 470 to the eighth mile. Top in charge and he pulls the shoot. 730. As the leader in the electronic fuel injection market, FAST continues to revolutionize the industry with its cutting edge EFI systems, ignition components, intake manifolds, fuel systems, and more. With an engineering and support staff unmatched in the performance aftermarket, FAST is simply the leading name in fuel air spark technology. FAST technicians are available by phone toll free on the EFI helpline at 1 877 334 8355 or check out fuelairspark.com.